to transfer data from old Android to the new Google Pixel 9 Pro or 9 Pro XL. If you haven't set up your Pixel 9 Pro yet, just head to the setup using another device screen. If the phone is already set up, we see the home screen here, then we will try opening settings. And if you see finish setting up Pixel or continue setup, we can tap on this one. We will then tap on start and we will be brought to the exact same screen. Now, if you do not have this option, you need to head to system. You then need to go to reset and do a full factory reset. And so we'll head back to the setup using another device screen. On your old Android, you should see set up new pixel. If you don't, then we will need to download the Google Lens app from the Google Play Store. So what we need to do is we'll tap the setup option. It will then connect your old phone to your new phone. If you're having connection issues, make sure Wi-Fi and Bluetooth are on in your old phone. And then we see scan the QR code. You either scan the QR code here or scan the QR code using the Google Lens app. So we place the QR code in the frame of the camera. And now it's gonna transfer your accounts from your old Android to your new Google Pixel. And it will also transfer some of your settings. So from here, just set up the phone until we see a certain screen. The screen in question is copy data from your Android device. To copy data over Wi-Fi, we'll tap on next. Hopefully that works just fine. To copy data over USB, which is faster, where you see this box, we're gonna tap this five times. So one, two, three, four, five. And you will see connect both devices. And this is the hidden menu to transfer data through the cable. So we'll connect the cable. If the charging cable for your Pixel 9 Pro or Pro XL is not connecting to your old phone, you will need to Google for a micro USB to USB-C cable, and you will need to buy that from Amazon. So we'll then tap on the copy data on the old phone. It will get ready to copy. You will see the screen even if you use the Wi-Fi option. We will then see, choose what to copy. You then tick or untick what you wanna copy, and then you tap the copy option to initiate the data transfer. Do note, not everything will transfer over. So if some stuff are missing, you'll have to re-sign into accounts or anything that doesn't transfer. 